we already know that the derivative of f x at x equals x note gives the slope of the tangent line to the graph of y equals f x at x equals x note. This section will go over problems that revolve around this concept. Let's draw a rough sketch to record the given information. The graph does not have to resemble the actual graph of y equals 3x squared plus 1. We are supposed to find the equation of the tangent line to the graph at x equals 1. The graph and tangent line both pass through the same point at x equals 1. We know the equation of the graph. We can easily find the y coordinate of the common point by plugging in x equals 1 to the equation of the graph. When x equals 1, y equals 4, therefore tangent line passes through the point 1, 4. The equation of a line whose slope is m and which passes through a point x1, y1 is given by 2. We already know a point just needs the slope. Let's m be the slope of the tangent line. The slope is given by the derivative at x equals 1. Differentiating 3x squared plus 1 we get 6x by substituting 1 for x we get 6. The slope of the tangent is 6. The tangent line passes through a point, 1, 4, and has a slope of 6. By substituting the information in the point slope form given by 2 we get y equals 6 times x minus 1 plus 4. Which is the equation of the tangent line at x equals 1. The figure below shows the actual graph and the tangent line. Even if we used this initially, it would not have provided any additional insight that would help solve the problem. The problem state that the tangent line passes through 0, 2. The point 0, 2 may not be on the graph. Let's check it by plugging 0, 2 into the equation of the graph. Points on the graph have coordinates x, y that make the statement of the equation true. Plugging 0, 2 to the equation y equals 2x squared plus 4 produce a false statement. The point 0, 2 is not on the graph of y equals 2x squared plus 4. We don't know the x coordinate of the tangent point. If we know the x coordinate, we could follow the steps in part a. Let the x coordinate be a, where a is an arbitrary constant. Let's draw a rough sketch to record the information. Let's follow the steps in part a while having a as x coordinate of the tangent point. The tangent point is on the graph of y equals 2x squared plus 4 and has an x coordinate of a. Therefore, we can find the y coordinate by substituting x equals a in y equals 2x squared plus 4. The point a to a squared plus 4 is on the tangent line. We need the slope of the tangent line. Let's label the slope by m. 
To find the slope of the tangent line at x equals a, differentiate and plug in x equals a. The point a to a squared plus 4 is on the tangent line, and the tangent line has a slope of 4a. Substituting this information in point slope form we get. If we can find the value of the arbitrary constant a we get the equation of the tangent line. To find a, we can construct an equation by using the fact the tangent line passes through 0 2. 0 2 should satisfy the equation of the tangent line. Therefore we get. We got two values for a. Each value gives a tangent line. Two tangent lines satisfy the given conditions. And they are.